make a quick video here about the latest um, little upcycle project I did. I found this thing um, on uh, Facebook Marketplace, and it is. Um, <coughs> I'll show you a picture. I'll put a picture up here of it, so you can see what it is. I wasn't quite sure what it was. I went to the guy's house to buy something else, and this thing was standing there, and he was like, "Okay, well." I've, 20 bucks you can <laughs> you can have it so um, yeah it what it is is it used to be a telephone stand where you put your telephone and then there's little space in the bottom you see there <clears throat> that's where you would put the telephone direction whatever you call that book <laughs> and the, you don't see them around anymore anyway but I, I like the oldness of it and I like the look of it and I thought it would look funky if I put it a little bit of a new spin on it so um, <clears throat> what I did is I turned I painted it all bright bright red like an apple red as you can see in the picture I'll put it up here and then I um, I took a I made a hole in the back where that little slot is and I I put a cord with a bulb in there so it could be like a nightlight so my 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 idea from the start was to kind of make it like a like a record player, a turntable stand. Seeing that the uh, LPs are getting big again and not, uh, people are looking for places to put their record player, so um, <clears throat> the idea was to like put your record player on top, and then at the bottom, as you can see here in this picture, there's a um, I got a little. A little container box from IKEA, so I put that in. It fitted perfectly in there I just put a two four brackets at the bottom as you can see in this picture here there's like four <coughs> regular shelf brackets I put in there just to put the box on and then so it was like you can put your records in this gray box and then you have your record player on top and then in that slot there you can put uh, whatever records you're playing at the moment that's on your actual record player you can like put it there so it's it's there and if anyone's wondering what's playing it's right there for them to see and then uh, yeah you even have like a light if you want to put it on I even made the light red as well <laughs> just to just for the fun of it just to keep everything just to keep everything red <coughs> so um, yeah in general I paid uh, just like I said in the previous video all of these prices are in uh, Canadian dollars I paid 20 Canadian for that for that piece I spend about 20 uh, just make it 20 20 on paint I used just to use just about the whole thing it was it took tons of layers to get that thing to get that thing red so I spent about 20 on that so it's 20 20 40 and then I spend another $25 on like the brackets and the light fitting and the wire and all like that. So all in all, <coughs> all in the, it cost me 65 uh, Canadian dollars as you can see as it looks like, <laughs> oh my goodness, words. As you can see in this picture um, here, I'll put it up. All finished, it was $65. And then, as usual, I put it on uh, Facebook Marketplace. And how much did it sell for? It's uh, I put it on for 150. I put it on for 150, and then at the end, I sold it for 130, which was my initial plan after all, because I always try to double what's in it. And uh, yeah, that does not account for the time and whatever. But anyway, if any time you can double your money, I think it's a good. <laughs> it's a good um, sign and like I said with the previous the previous video on that that bar I did didn't make such a good profit on that and I said I was gonna try to get closer to a hundred per project so yeah, getting there 65 is uh, it's better than I cannot exactly remember what that one was it was like 35 or 40 dollars profit anyway so yeah we're not we're not getting rich <laughs> we're not getting rich fast but uh, the profit is improving a bit and um, yeah I love doing these things it's just fun for me to like take a, something old and just just stare at it and think what can I do to make it better and to give it a new lease on life and uh, so yeah I have this I have this one will uh, be 
become a record stand in someone's house and that they can use it for years to come they get some joy out of it and uh <clears throat> yeah that's about it um like i said before uh subscribe and put the notification button if you uh would like to see the next project and find out more like how where to buy these things and how much i paid for them and how much i sell for them to give you like a more or less a base idea what things are selling for and what you can get them for and where you can get them and then uh yeah if you're interested uh, here on the side of this video i'll put some i'll put some woodworking plans some how to set up your shop how to start your own wood profits <coughs> uh, your own business and pro start profit from woodworking and upcycling and stuff so check it out if you're interested if you're not and you just enjoy this video thank you so much for watching and uh yeah hopefully i'll bring you i'll bring a lot more of these videos in the future and we can get closer to that hundred dollar profit soon anyway that's it for now cheers bye <laughs>